is you that have been living in complacency Lakini ikiwa huyo ni wewe ambaye umekuwa ukiishi katika mazoea That for a long time you heard about the announcement on the coming of the Messiah Ya kwamba kwa muda mrefu kabisa umesikia kuhusiana na tangazo la kuja kwa Masiya And you heard all these sayings about righteousness how is important the messages on the need for you now to stand with the holiness of God Na umesikia ujumbe huu wote kuhusiana na jinsi ambavyo ni muhimu kabisa na hitaji la kwa wewe kusimama kwa ajili ya uhaki wa Mungu that you may now walk a holy christian lifestyle ili kwamba sasa upate kutembea mtindo wa maisha ya kikristo iliyo takatifu but the way you lived you were not aware that it can happen any second now even as i stand here lakini jinsi ambavyo umeishi huku jo ya kwamba haitatendeka dakika yoyote sekunde yoyote hata wakati huu na inaweza kaatendeka so yeah. that, 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 that you were not aware that it can happen any time any second even as i stand here ya kwamba huku jo ya kwamba inaweza ikatendeka wakati wote hata wakati huu ambapo nimesi And you have looked back and you've seen your pitfalls the flaws where you have failed no, your angali- shortcomings na umeangalia nyuma umeangalia ma, umeona mahali ambapo umepungukiwa mahali ambapo umekosea and you feel that you want to return to Jesus tonight na unahisia kwamba unataka kumrudia Yesu siku ya leo repeat this quick prayer rudia ombi hili la haraka say mighty lord jesus sema bwana yesu mkuu i repent totally from sin total Ninatubu kikamilifu kabisa kutoka kwa dhambi. And turn away from sin totally. Na kugeuka kutoka kwa dhambi kikamilifu. I have heard. Nimesikia. My Lord Jesus. Bwana wangu Yesu. I have heard. Nimesikia. That your coming will be abrupt. Ya kwamba kuja kwako kutakuwa ghafla. An imminent return. Kurudi kwa kighafla that is not announced ambaye haitangazi that time and date cannot be attached to ambayo siku sana tarehe haiwezi kuambatanishwa nayo and so tonight na kwa hivyo usiku wa leo i repent for complacency ninatubu kabisa kwa ajili ya makubaliano i repent for living my christian life carelessly na ninatubu kwa sababu ya kuishi maisha yangu ya kikristo bila kujali and i receive you my lord jesus into my heart nami ninakupokea wewe bwana wangu yesu katika moyo wangu on this auspicious night katika usiku huu wa kupendeza i receive you in my heart ninakupokea katika moyo wangu and repent from all my sin na kutubu kutoka kwa dhambi zangu zote and ask you my lord jesus na kukuuliza wewe bwana wangu yesu to come and enter into my heart uje ukaingie katika moyo wangu and be my lord na uwe bwana wangu and my savior na mwokozi wangu and preserve me na unihifadhi and separate me na unitenge totally from sin kikamilifu kutoka kwa dhambi i ask you my lord jesus ninakuuliza bwana wangu yesu my savior mwokozi wangu please tafadhali kindle my mind Washa ukapate kuhakisha akili zangu. Kindle my soul. Ukaweze kuamsha nafsi yangu. Kindle my heart. Ukapate kuamsha moyo wangu. On the glorious coming of the Messiah. Kusiana na kuja kwa utukufu kwa Masiya. And sensitize me. Na upate kunimakinisha. On sin. Kuhusu dhambi. And keep me alert. Na ukapate kunimakinisha. And watchful. Na nikikesha. And ready. Na nikiwa tayari. For the glorious coming of the Messiah. Kwa ajili ya kuja kwa utukufu kwa Masiya. Tonight. Usiku wa leo. I have received you. Nimekupokea. As my Lord. Kama bwana wangu. And my Savior. Na mwokozi wangu. And I'm born again. Nami nimeokoka. In the mighty name of Jesus. Katika jina kula Yesu. Amen. Amina. If you have said that prayer that is the best decision you can ever make. Kama umesema hilo ombi huo ndio uma uamuzi ulio bora kabisa ambao unaweza kufanya. You can now share with people, you can talk to people, you can tweet them, you can text them, tell them I am born again. Sasa unaweza I kush- want to see Twitter globally lighting up with people writing I am born again. I am born again. Sasa, Hallelujah, una, what a mighty revival of being born again. Unaweza kushiriki na watu, unaweza kuandikia watu jumbe katika mitandao za Twitter, mitandao kila mahali. Sasa nataka niwone Twitter yote iwake na watu wakiandika ya kwamba mimi leo nimeokoka. I want to see Twitter light up tonight with people writing globally saying I am born again. Sasa, tonight na, I'm born again. Nataka, I have received the Lord. Nataka Twitter yote iwake usiku wa leo watu wakiandika na kusema ya kwamba mimi leo nimeokoka. So if you get a chance if this is your first time to receive Christ Hivyo basi kama hii ni mara yako ya kwanza kumpokea Kristo You can start reading the Bible make sure you get a normal Bible don't take a Mormon Bible don't take Jehovah's Witness word don't take SDA word take a Bible 
anza kuchukua biblia usichukue biblia ya mormon usichukue biblia ya sda biblia ya jehovah witness chukua biblia ya biblia take NIV bible king james bible amplified chukua biblia niv king james amplified and read from the book of john chapter 1 go down na uanze kusoma kuanzia kitabu cha yohana sura ya kwanza kuendelea when you finish you can read the book of romans ukifali ukimaliza unaweza kusoma kitabu cha warumi and then go back to the gospels alafu urudi kwa vitabu vya injili the lord will help you bwana atakusaidia if you have crossed from another religion Kama umevuka kutoka kwa dini nyingine From this point on you don't go back to those temples of idol worship Kuanzia wakati huu kuendelea usirudi katika hizo hekalu za sanamu But you now pray in the mighty name of Jesus Sasa uombe katika jina kuu la Yesu May the Lord bless you Bwana awabariki